It's hard to forget all the snow that was piled high in Kevin Land this past winter, but with the hot June we had, it is all starting to feel like a distant memory. It really is, isn't it? Yeah. Now, you may be wondering, did those big giant snow piles around Sioux Falls, did they finally melt? Yeah, some ah. thought maybe they'd stick around. In our top story tonight, Kellan's or Lauren Solik brings us that answer. If anyone had bets going with friends that the Sioux Falls snow piles would be melted before August, congratulations, you can cash in. This was the last one to kind of be melted. We had nine across the city and probably two or three in the last uh, couple weeks that uh, have finally melted with some warmer summer temps. Now all that's left of a winter many of us thought wouldn't end is garbage and debris like fragmented manhole covers, chunks of streets, singular shoes, and broken electronics. Sometimes we joke like, is there any money in there? But uh, no money was found this year. Uh, but there's all kinds of things, of course, you know, pop bottles and just general debris, obviously a lot of gravel, things of that. So uh, just, just the various of things that uh, can be found in those piles. Now, of course, there is still standing water left from all the melted snow, which Hansen says will eventually make its way to the outlet to drain. Once things dry up, the cleanup process continues. We started on some of the other ones that kind of melted about a month ago. You know, we were out uh, doing some hand picking of litter and, and got some volunteers within the city um, staff to kind of pick some of that litter up. And well, on this on this site, we might use some machines to kind of rake it up and then we'll pick it up with a loader and then haul it to the, the local landfill here. Then Hansen says they'll regrade the site and get ready for next winter. Hopefully we get a, a few more months, a warm months, and, and winter doesn't come back for a while. In Sioux Falls, Lauren Solick, Kelloland News.